Our Lady Toulouse de Maria de Bonilla on March 28, 2021. Beloved children of my Immaculate Heart, beginning Holy Week, my maternal heart wishes to remain active in each one of you. My children, let us begin this commemoration of the self-sacrifice of my Divine Son with the knowledge which the Most Holy Trinity has allowed you to have through these appeals. The Passion of my Son Jesus Christ is not only latent during this Holy Week, but every day, every week, every month, every year it impregnate a person's life in all their actions and works, in the suffering and joys of all their brothers and sisters. My son passes in front of you and you do not recognize him, like the disciples on the way to Amos. You need to focus on knowing my son, you need stillness as you work and act so that the Holy Divine Spirit would enlighten and inspire you and so that you would not be hasty in your actions, so as not to be led away from my son by them. Temptations are stronger now than at other times in human history, with the battle against spiritual, and in some cases physical evil, being palpable, this you cannot deny. Human beings are slow to recognize my son because they do not reason but behave due to inertia, by imitation, or out of compliance. You will not reach eternal life this way. You need to focus on spiritual life and not focus on external things that are temporary. LK 24-25 Enough of half-hearted commitments, of promises that you do not fulfill, of being like rivers after a storm, carrying mud and filth along with you without managing to cleanse your souls. Purity of heart is urgent, this is the time for conscious repentance in truth, time to ask for forgiveness to make reparation and to continue being led by the hand of my son. Your intentionality is very necessary, intentional development of your actions or works is decisive on the path of salvation, right and healthy intention is profitable and results in a flourishing in each one of you of that which previously was hidden, leading you towards the good. My son's church is changing. Will she become a church without a mother? Children, live within the true magisterium of the church of my son. Do not succumb to easy rules that do not require sacrifice, conversion, surrender, prayer, unity, witness, fasting, love of neighbor, and above all the worship of the Holy Trinity. Participation in the innovations will lead you to perdition, ignorance, and being dependent in your work and behavior. It will make you succumb regarding your values and good habits. It will lead you to give your consent to norms that are not the divine will. As mother, I invite you to live each day with the goal of improving, of ordering your spiritual life of finding within the cross of my son true peace, true love, abundant goodness, the antidote for impatience, intolerance, for an aggressive character, domination, misunderstanding and authoritarianism. These and other defects take root in the human being until man can no longer identify them. This is the time to be liberated from human obstacles and to surrender to my son. How little you understand, and how slow are your hearts to believe all that the prophets have announced. Pray, my children, pray for the peace of the world. Pray, my children, pray, receive my son in the Eucharist. Pray, my children. 
pray, look at the cross, meditate upon and unite with it. Beloved children of my Immaculate Heart, do not fear what is to come. Do not fear, fear paralyzes. I bless you. Thank you.